characters. With logos, you're dealing with a super sharp image that people see hundreds of times a day sometimes. Explain, here it goes, A is for ambition, be what I wanna be, see past the situation that's in front of me. What is up guys, it's Joseph Arden, welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel. But anyways, in today's video, I'm gonna be painting the iconic LV logo all over my in Fujifilm Instax mini camera um, that I got a really long time ago. Basically, I got this camera, and if any of you own this camera, you already know, it just sits on your counter for months and months and months without doing anything because the film is way too expensive to justify buying every time. I'm thinking if it's gonna sit around in my room and for people that to just come and stare at every day, it might as well look cool. So I'm gonna paint the LV logo all over this thing, and if you want to stay to see that happen, just keep on watching. What's funny is in painting videos, people either commit to one of two things. They either do really great high production videos with lots of editing to make it look cool, or they decide to just do a really awesome painting and let the work speak for itself. Well, in my case, I decide to commit to neither and employ the help of Photoshop magic to make it look like I actually did the work when I didn't. But I can completely explain there's a completely justifiable reason. When I tried to actually go in and do each monogram properly, I just don't have brushes that are thin enough right now and I don't, didn't really feel like going to get some. So I wanted to just use Photoshop to show you guys what it would look like if I had finished even though I didn't finish because I would hate to see a video that starts out one way but then I don't ever get to see the finished product. So here you guys go, enjoy. Alright guys, so I know it was like a little bit of a turn, I kind of lied, I kind of, it was, so I think, I thought it was just cool to show you guys like, how I could just like manipulate it and just make it look like I did it even though I didn't, but I promise at some point I will get back to it, it's just that I didn't have the right tools because to really get in the corner of the um, logos, because there's, with logos you're dealing with a super sharp image that people see hundreds of times a day sometimes, and we know what it looks like exactly when it's, we see it. So if it doesn't look right, our eye will be able to catch that immediately. And I didn't want to like go through the trouble of like trying to use my crappy brushes to just keep redoing that and making you guys watch me redo a crusty logo a hundred times. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna cut this video short. Maybe continue it later and put in some Photoshop magic to see what happens. So besides that, all that extra information if you like this video please subscribe follow me on all my social media instagram will be linked below and i will see you guys in the next video the agony is they inspire me to love them g is past go with ignite the cash flow when eights is put your heart and whatever's your last hope